what's happening? My name's Keith. Here we are, downtown Minneapolis, Minnesota. Home of Risen Drums. It's passion for drums, and that's why I'm in this. That's why Risen Drums started. Myself as a drummer, yeah, all my life, man. I started playing drums. My parents bought me a drum kit in sixth grade, and they just encouraged it in me, you know? It was never like, this is too loud in the house and it went from there, uh, got in a band, did some you know, minimal touring and stuff. I had a buddy that was just interested in drums, and so he said, if I make a drum kit, would you play it? So we did, and that's how it started. I played the first ever Risen drum kit. As I was playing shows, I found someone who bought that kit, sold it to him, and uh, we made a second kit. And then from there, just went to the next best thing. Instead of being on the road, for me, was to build them. So you know, I could still be involved with them, but I can still sleep in my own bed at night. You know, you wake up every morning and go, wow, I'm actually doing this. Like, you know, one day this was building a drum kit once every two months in my buddy's living room, and now it's, let's get hustling because there's a lot of drums to make. <laughs> None of us sat down and said, here's a business plan, here's a good idea for uh, uh, something we can do or something that's gonna make us money. It was something we were passionate about, it was something we loved, and it worked. Sold the drum kit to a, to a kid named Grady who was a smoking drummer and he had nothing better to do but hang around the shop all the time. So he would come and uh, putz with us as we were building stuff and, and pretty soon he knew how to do everything. So it just made sense that he started working with us and, and now he does. So here's how Risen Drums works. Risen Drums is a custom drum shop. If you're buying a Risen kit, this is the place to buy it from. You can't buy the drums in a store. Uh, you can't find them from a dealer anywhere. You get them right from here, so you're basically talking to me. We don't build anything until it's ordered. We are true custom drums. We're doing drums one at a time. Uh, they're specific to you, like they're, they're specific to who's playing them uh, based on tons of things, based on color and finish and sizes and thickness and depth. And there are hundreds of things in drums that can change depending on how you want them. And all that stuff comes then by just building one at a time. Now the, the building process takes some time as far as you know, getting exact colors down, sizes, depth, uh, what they're gonna look like, what they're gonna feel like. Uh, there's tons of stuff in drums that comes specifically to your drum kit. You have created a monster and it will destroy you. You can do anything. We have a bunch of finishes that are kind of available to start with. But if you call me up and you say, I want some drums and I don't know where to go, then the sky's the limit. We can really start dreaming as far as what we want to make. You can do just a basic satin finish, or just a, a simple color on the drums, really classy, really mature. You can bump that up to doing like rap stuff where you see the sparkles. You can put some stripes into that to get a little crazier, down to furry stuff, down to fabric. Then you're talking about high gloss stuff where you're clear coating it in the end. Anything from just a, a normal sunburst or a, a, a fade of color to painting stripes on it, painting designs in there, painting your band logo in there, painting your name on it. You can do colored hardware, so you're adding on different different colors instead of just a the chrome. Then there's options with, with different hoops, thicknesses of shells, how the bearing edges is cut, it can even change the sound of your drum. So if you know what you want, I can make it exactly how you want it. If you don't know what you want, then we can go round and round until we got it perfect. <laughs> When the day is over, we're going, I can't wait to get this drum kit together to see how it sounds or to see what it looks like. There's still joy and happiness in getting a drum done and looking at it and going, man, this is sweet. Uh, and then we got to mail it out to somebody instead of play it. But There's kind of a reason why we do the stuff that we're doing. There are things in drums that can be better. When I first started building drums, I, I just really dug into this to go, what are the good things and bad things about how drums are made and how can we change that? We spent a lot of time learning about this stuff. The idea behind Risen Drums is, if I know everything about drums and how they work, what are the 100 things that happens when you hit a drum head and it's gonna breathe somewhere and it's compressed in there? Different woods are gonna absorb differently or if it's not wood, how's that gonna change it? There's millions of questions that if you start asking those questions and finding the answers, then you're gonna figure out how to build them better. There's a venting system on Risen that's different than anything else you've ever seen or played. So the drum is breathing uh, the best way that it, to get maximum resonance. When you pick up a Risen kick drum, you think there's something wrong with it because it's so light. Uh, a light shell is gonna resonate more. A thinner shell, the bigger the boom. The thicker the shell, the higher the pitch. 
Okay, so kick drum and toms, we want thin, we want as light as can be so they can resonate. We have an aluminum lug, which nobody has. Most lugs are brass. Aluminum means it's lighter. Uh, the, the bearing edges, they're double 45, so they're working as far as tunability, and the kick drum on a risen kit is just booming. There's a thing we call the family of risen drums. Relationships are everything. The idea that we're custom and not in stores, that we build drums one at a time for someone specifically, is totally based on relationships. It's based on developing something more than just making money, more than just having a job. And when do I start and is it time to go home yet? We love drums. Obviously drummers that are buying these love drums too, so we got a lot in common. We like to be involved with the guys that are playing Risen Drums. We are a small enough company that we can be one-on-one -on -one with the guys that are getting these drums and playing them so we can kind of follow what they're doing. There is this family thing that when you're in, we're gonna take care of you, and so are the other guys around. The bottom line is, if you play Risen Drums, you're gonna love your drums because we take care of the guys that are playing them. We're just so happy to have our favorite bands playing our drums and digging them. Like, what an honor. We just say, man, thank you God for what this is. I mean, like, somehow there's blessing in there that this thing is working. The name Risen Drums comes from Jesus. I'm passionate about Jesus, I'm passionate about drums. Drums are my are the thing that I love in life. If I can do that and incorporate where God is leading with that, then perfect. There is a bigger picture here. There is something, something more happening. We love drums, so we're here and we're doing this stuff and day to day, it's, it's fun to be involved in and we have jobs that we love. Everybody else that's working here loves drums and that's why we're doing this. There's nobody here that's just good at running a saw or knows how to run a router or is a good painter. They're making them because they're passionate about drums. When you do things that you're passionate about, good stuff's gonna happen. This is my dream job. This is exactly what I wanna do.